Hi guys. Hello, 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 hello. I am here to read the good news daily to you today. It's a nice day outside. Very, very, very nice. And I believe I'm a little overdressed because it is too nice outside. Me and Sophia decided to come out to the park, walk. I got my Starbucks. So good. And so here is baby Sophia. Yep. Yeah, she has definitely conked out. So thought we were doing a joint venture today, but Sophia didn't make it. She didn't last. <laughs> so let us get started. So I'm rereading from the Good News Daily. If you haven't gotten your hard copy, let me know. DM me and um, I'll see how I can get you some or at least one. Or if you want many, something to share. But if not, you can always go to goodnewsworld.com and download the PDF. So let us get started. Today, our topic is you are bilingual. The text comes from Jude 1 verse 20. And oh my goodness, I've been running from this train at this park, but it keeps going by, so whatever. The, um, the text reads Jude 1 and verse 20. But ye, beloved, building up yourselves on your most holy faith, praying in the Holy Ghost. Ah, praying in the Holy Ghost. I love it. I love it. I love it. Speaking in tongues is just simply amazing. And I love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. So I'd like to give honor to my highly esteemed prophet, um, Ambassador Prophet Hubert Angels and Prophetess BB Angel for writing the good news daily. Oh my goodness. So they say, our text is, speaking in tongues is not as mysterious as some would have you to believe. It is the supernatural native language of the Christian. That is why no matter what part of the world you come from, every Christian can speak it. <laughs> Isn't that something? Every Christian can speak this common language of tongues. It's common. The prophets say it is common. It is the language of the spirit and is an inborn supernatural ability that is given to you the moment you are born again. The moment you confess that, you, that Jesus Christ is Lord. Receive him into your heart. Oh my goodness, guess what? You receive this ability to speak in tongues. The Holy Spirit will not pry your mouth open. Just as with your natural earthly language, you open your mouth and expect to speak. That's simple. You supply the sound, that's it. He supplies the words. Oh my goodness, it's a no brainer. You don't have to think of anything. Just open your mouth, supply the sound and the Holy Spirit supplies the words. It is a wonderful cooperation between your body, spirit, and the Holy Spirit. Paul was a phenomenon. The secret to his tremendous impact was, I, he's, Paul says, I speak in tongues more than all of you. As you chart your course through this year, now more than ever, it is critical for you to employ this powerful resource of speaking in tongues. I mean, everyone who knows, who speaks in tongues, knows how our lives change when we speak in tongues, when we, I, so much says speaking in tongues has a multitude of benefits it sharpens your sensitivity to the word it gives instructions to angels it repairs any part of your life and body that is broken down my goodness there's healing and speaking in tongues you can say one word in tongues and it can have more impact than a multiplicity of words in your earthly language don't miss the supernatural waiting for the spectacular you don't have to wait for a special feeling or event to speak in tongues you are the God kind, and you speak the God kind of language. You are the God kind, and you speak the God kind of language. What is God's language? I just had to repeat that. You are the God kind. You speak the God kind of language. What is God's kind of language? Speaking in tongues. Amen. Expect to speak. Expect it. Open your mouth and begin to speak now. I love speaking in tongues and doing it even with a smile on my face. I love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. Yes, 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 Brother Stephen. Prayer walk. I, I am two minutes from a park and 
it's simply amazing i'm just excited even thinking about establishing one so thank you for mentioning it because i was thinking it too we're on one accord <laughs> So our prophetic declaration today is written by a highly esteemed prophet, and it says, if you're with me, read it with me or um, repeat after me. As I speak in tongues right now, I am declaring the word of the Lord. Mountains are being moved. Help is permeating my body. Ideas are flowing to me. My faith is being raised to another level and angels are being dispatched to work on my behalf. Can you imagine that power speaking in tongues, all that's happening, everything that's going on in your life, healing, ideas, business ideas, prosperity, wealth. Can you imagine family, everything, just speaking in tongues. So if you want further reading, it um, comes from 1 Corinthians chapter 14 and verse 18. That is the end. It brings me to the conclusion of reading our Good News Daily today. And if you haven't already, do so. Download it as a PDF onto all of your devices. Hey, if you're like me, grab you a cup of coffee. The baby is sleeping. Ah, what a beautiful moment on a beautiful day. And don't forget to speak in tongues. Thanks, guys, for listening, and see you next live. Bye.